Hey guys, welcome back to another tutorial video. Today I'm going to show you how to create a thumbnail for free. So there are many software applications out there that you can use to create a thumbnail. Uh, there, there are some that are great, some that are not so good. Uh, I usually use Photoscape. I think is uh, very easy to use, uh, very straightforward. So I wanted to create a, a short video to show you exactly how to create a thumbnail. So what you'll do is just uh, go to Google, type in Photoscape, and it should be the first link that you see here up top. When you click on that link, um, I see that I have to go up here. I want to get the Photoscape X. Click on that link, and it should give you two options, one for Windows, and one for Mac. Of course, I'm using the Mac, so I have this version here on the right-hand side. So once you click on that, you download, you install, um, you will open the program, which is right over here, Photoscape, and you're gonna go to Editor. Now, they have other uh, selections here up top. Um, for now, just keep it real simple. Just go to Editor. And here, I'm going to create a thumbnail for you. I'm going to drag here. And I'm going to insert right up top here. I'm going to insert uh, text. So click on text. And I'm just going to title this How to Create a Thumbnail. So I'm going to actually put this at the bottom right there. And right over here, you can click and then you can drag this to enlarge. And you can, you know, click and hold and drag to where you want the words to go. So I'm just going to leave it like right up here. Okay, maybe down here. And now, if you want to insert uh, a picture or an actual image, you can click on image and you can select. I'm just going to select this. So, right here, this arrow, you can place this wherever you like. Now, this little button right here up top, this allows you to move the image around. So I think that's pretty neat, pretty simple, straightforward. Now, if you want to remove uh, any of these pictures or, or uh, text, just click on the image. And then there's this little X on the right top right hand side. And you can just click that to remove it. Now, I'm just going to add a little bit more. You can actually change the color of the text. Um, you could do uh, an outer glow and you can change the color uh, to change the actual color for the words. See the white right here? You can click on that and you can select any other color you like. I'm just going to do, sure, why not, green. And the cool thing about this program is there's stock stickers, emojis, and uh, you can use those for your thumbnail. I'm gonna, let me see, I'm just gonna select one of these. Why not? We'll go with this one. And I'm just gonna. Enlarge this right here. Now, right here at the right hand side, you can drop shadow and then you can you can play around with this and change it. Blur the angle. I mean, you could do so much with this program. And the great thing about it is it's absolutely free. Um, I'm just going to leave it like this. And let me see, 
just going to enlarge this a little bit more. Place it in the middle right here. There we go. And now to save your progress, you can continue adding uh, if you want to. Uh, to save your progress, right here at the bottom, you can click Save. And then I'm going to just do Save As and just name, I'll leave some bus. You can name it whatever you like. And then this is already saving to my desktop, so I know where it's going. And I'm just going to click Save. And it's right up top, right over here. So uh, if you wanted to, of course, uh, use this for a video you just created or um, create a thumbnail uh, for, uh, for anything, really, uh, this is a great program, Photoshop Escape X completely free, has a lot of different tools. Uh, you can even add figures and then just add color to the, all these figures and this is absolutely free. Um, numbers, um, images. So like I said, they have a lot of tools. It is completely free and it's what I use to create thumbnails. Uh, so I hope this video was helpful. I'll be making a few more videos uh, next week. So please be on the lookout for that. I will see you guys on the next video. Hope you have a great day. Peace.